Can you see the rainbow, rainbow, rainbow? That means it's going to be a good day. Hi guys, it's Monday. I am at work. I am soaked to the bone. Any little bit of makeup I had is gone. But yeah, it's Vlogtober day 28. Um, and the really bad weather warnings here in Cornwall. Um, the house, we didn't get battered too badly. Woke up a few times because of the wind in the night, but nothing really horrendous. Um, but the rain is horrible. And I say, I am drenched. And I was like, I was at the second bus stop and I saw this beautiful rainbow. And I was like, oh, maybe it's over. And it's like, no, it's not. So I'm wet and I'm cold. <sighs> And I've got lots of work to do, so I'll see you later. Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Um, it's now about half past five and I am at home. Um, I got home about four-ish. But if you're in the UK, you probably know that our weather warnings, wind, rain, and it seems to be a little bit hit and miss who's getting it. Um, I follow this lovely guy called Matty here on YouTube. Um, he's in Cornwall, the same as I am, but he's in North Cornwall, I believe, where I'm in deepest, darkest west. And he said it's fine where he is. I, on the other hand, got drenched <laughs> on the way home. And um, one of the roads near where I work was closed because um, a tree had fallen over. So there was diversions on the bus. Drama. So I kind of come home and I got changed and it took me a while to get warm. And I've literally been playing with the puppies and... Um, on YouTube. The boys oh, are cute. You can see the mess you've had playing. You can also see, I'm not sure, see, you see the bottom, the shelving under my cooker has come off. And I would be tempted to blame Gilly, apart from it happened while I was at work today, and you guys probably know, Gilly's crated during the day, and Darwin's loose, so I don't know if it's just fallen off, or Darwin decided to have a play with it. But I'm gonna leave it there and let John put it back together because he's better at that kind of thing. Hopefully, John will be home within about an hour and got um, a really easy, simple chuck it in the oven tea tonight and we can just chill and be comfortable. Our house is, lucky, you know, the house is quite warm. Obviously, I'm just in a strappy vest top and I'm comfortable because um, we have a really well insulated home. I could talk more about that because I'm a geep, geep, geek, um, but I'm sure I bore you guys enough. But look, look how dark it is. So dark. Obviously because the clocks, it's a looking lighter, but that's because it's got the reflection of my lights rather than the, how dark it is. It's proper. Oh, there's another light on. It is pitch black. You just have to... You just have to trust me. So, yes. That's kind of what's going on right about now. Um, what else do I know? That vlog... Mm, Vlogtober is almost over. Which I'm kind of happy about because I... Every day I almost feel like I'm letting you guys down. Because, you know... I'm not fleur de force, I'm not flying to LA or doing this, this and that. I go to work and I stay at home and I chill my puppies. <laughs> and I also feel like I let you down because I don't film and edit and upload on the same day. I'm normally a couple of days behind because, yeah, it's kind of not in my skill set. So I'm looking forward to not having the guilt. <laughs> but I think I may miss the interaction. Um, that I get with you guys, um, definitely, definitely considering Vlogmas, um, would really appreciate what you guys think if I should do Vlogmas, you know, if you're bored of me, let me know, um, that's just asking for haters, isn't it, but at least I suppose it'd be your honest, um, opinion, um, what else, it's nine Mon there's nine Mondays till Christmas, I'm so excited, I love Christmas, it's my favourite thing in the world, um, I watched Elaine's, Elaine's video, I've watched, I think I've watched three Elaine videos, I watched her 300 video, um, earlier this morning before I went to work, and watched Primark haul, and 
and then I watched video 299 and there was lots of Christmas decorations she went to a shopping centre and there was loads of Christmas lights and then she bought Christmas decorations and it just made me get excited um, but yeah go and check it out you can see these amazing Christmas lights in the shopping centre I can't remember what she's called it but it's it's I know it's her 299th video so go and check it out um, yes I'm gonna stop rambling um, I'm gonna go and spend a little bit more time on you YouTube um, before John gets home. And for this evening's meal we have a pasta bake, um, I think it's called a meat feast pasta bake from Sainsbury's and some garlic bread. Hi guys, so it's a bit later now, we've eaten, the puppies have eaten, um, we're watching some Bake Off. What else has happened? Hmm. Gilly Monster decided that the carpet was a good place to poo. Not fun. <sighs> so yes, me and John were kings of teamwork and picked up poo from inside the house. The rain and the wind is definitely here. Lots of people that are complaining on Facebook that there's no storm. Well, it's windy woos in Cornwall. Um, yeah, gonna watch a bit more telly. So it is about quarter to 11 I have just uploaded Friday's vlog um, we watched the last episode of this year's Great British Bake Off um, yeah spoiler alert for anyone else that hasn't watched it but it was on like last week so I think I'd be okay um, Francis won and did I really want her to win? I really liked Kimberley. I wanted her to win. But to be fair, Francis Francis had the best wedding cake, so she kind of deserved it in the end. But Kimberley was my favourite like all the way through. But yeah, I really enjoy that program. Makes me want to make cake. Well, makes me want to eat cake. <laughs> um, but yeah, so as I said, it is quarter to eleven, so it is bedtime. We've got two sleepy boys. So yeah, I'm going to leave it there and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.